Advent is starting. This religious occurrence is a beautiful and challenging journey that will lead us to Christmas. And I would like to share this journey with you as well. In today's Gospel, Jesus addresses his disciples with a somewhat mysterious prophecy that is difficult for them and for us to understand. Jesus announces that terrible things will happen on earth, things which will make people anxious, but which will also be the time to raise their heads because salvation is near. What does this prophecy mean? I will try to explain it with Julia's words. Julia is a university student who wrote to me a few days ago. Dear Father Fabio, my grandmother is a wonderful person, but not very optimistic. She listens to seven newscasts a day, and when I visit her, she greets me with her press review, which sounds like a festival of doom. She says that nuclear war will break out soon, that we will not survive climate change, that no one has any respect for others anymore. In short, we are one step away from catastrophe. Honestly, I can see it myself that things are not going well. The world is what it is, but I don't want to spend my life complaining, like grandma. I would like to raise my head and do my part. I thought about it for a long time, and I have finally decided to enroll in the socio-political formation course offered by my diocese. Sometimes it may not seem like it, but politics is a very serious matter. It is the noble art that can change the world, and I, in my own small way, have chosen to try. Let me at least have that hope. Besides, Grandma has already promised me her vote. Great! Dear friends, with the freshness of her enthusiasm, Julia has explained today's Gospel to us. Now it's our turn to roll up our sleeves and get down to work to save the world. Our families, our neighborhood, our city, our school, our work environment, with our presence as Christians. We entrust the rest to the Savior, the one with a capital S. Happy Advent Journey.